Welcome everyone, all my gods and goddesses to the 305 Goddess Channel. I appreciate you all for being here, tuning in, subscribing, liking the video, the love in the comment section. Let's see who we have in the hot seat pop out. Water sign. <laughs> I can't see in this light. Gemini. So when I thought it was back to back air signs, it was actually back to back water signs. And theirs did not even get recorded. So let's go in, Gemini. What happened? What you doing? What you need to be doing? Virgo. Let's see. Let's see what it's talking about. Mm. Earth sign. Yep. Virgo, Taurus, Capricorn. Come on, I want another card, Gemma. Shit, be down to earth to get your opportunities. That's all I can think about right now. Virgo don't want to show down, so it keeps showing up. Okay, so you up against this Virgo, you're going to have to be down to earth. Take some of that energy. Other than that, some of you need to just really be down to earth. Which is more so opportunist for your life other than that you live in other people's life you're living in their bubble instead of yours you need to live your bubble virgo energy Scattered Gemini. This energy is everywhere. One more good card. I mean, shuffle. Good. All right. Eight of Pentacles. You need to be building, right? You were building. Something happened? What happened? Hmm. You were giving too much love. Well, it's a little bit. That's a little bit, but somehow you were giving too much Premature, immature love. I see somebody just handing it here. Okay, so as they hand it. Mm. Okay. Being independent. So what that led you single-handedly independent knight of pentacles so you can go so you decided you were going to be independent so you can go get an opportunity right the earth i was talking about right the lovers being you yes okay the lovers so you wanted to go really be in love with the opportunities that you were getting and somehow this death came maybe because you had to end more than what you felt that you did before you can really get it jumping off and we are four cups, so you can go ahead and take the real and right opportunity in this 100% standing. Okay. So, let's see what you're doing. Fighting hard for everything you deserve. Sounds like a great idea, right? Nice. Six 
Six of Pentacles, having some even give and take. That's what you're doing. You probably didn't have none. So, you know, somewhere in the past, so you decided I'm going to be single handedly independent and get what I really need. So here we are, um, the strength card. Realize you don't need no strength, right? You feel like you have some power, magician. With the lovers here, that is all Gemini. So make the magic happen. Now that you are in that full moon energy with the magician and the lovers in your position. And speaking of the moon, you in full moon. It's reverse. It's time to do things, right? Time to get it done. As the cycle come back up, then it's gonna be something new to tackle and handle. And here we are. Some of you not looking at it for what it is. Damn, that's why I'm explaining it. I'm figure out how why I'm going so hard because you don't see. You're not looking at that. You don't see that point of view. But that's going to bring you to some even give and take. You want some, you need some, but you're going to have to make the magic happen, especially since you can't see it for what it is. So at least start off with understanding you are powerful. You have this type of magical powers from the universe to create at the touch of things. So when you touch it, hold it in your hand. See, some of you... You don't understand that once you hold it in your hand, you make the magic happen. See, some of you, like, I'm making the magic happen. That shit working is because you're not going forward in every magical possible way. Somehow you're going to have to form. I did, that's what I see, Gemini. Okay, yeah, you have to decide to do so. I, I'm not a Gemini, so I don't know you guys' powers. But looking at what I'm seeing, if I had these powers, I would end... Everything that that is ne neglecting me and face everything that I'm neglecting. Okay? You're going to have to choose to do that. Because you are very powerful. I know me being a Libra, all the magical powers I hold, you're going to have to figure out the ones you hold, Gemini. Okay, so collaborating. That's what you need to be doing. Okay, see some of you are denying yourself the power. You just kind of moving throughout this universe. You know, as a Gemini, yeah, I done went through stuff. I don't need the strength I get over it. I'm just going to make something happen next. No, <laughs> uh-uh, uh-uh. No, it's just not that simple. Okay, so, yeah, um, what you need to do is stop waiting. Three of Wands reverse. It's a certain path that you have to take right now. Okay, and you know that. A lot of you is no secret. So, it's like you're making the magic happen, but not at the 1,000% 1, power. I just, whatever. So, it's conflict here. So, stop waiting because it's conflict. The reason it's conflict is because you're not moving into your greater power. So, the longer you don't do it, the more conflict just coming out of nowhere. For nothing, right? Anyhow, you don't have no option but to work on that. You don't have nothing else that's going to hold you or sustain you. So, um, here we are. You being tormented until you figure it out. You have to be independent. Get on this horse. Go after certain opportunities that you actually love that's in your heart. And let that bring a death to all your conclusions so you can actually learn how to continue taking great opportunities. Okay, go forward with that chariot. Some of you are afraid to put a death to your past. Thinking, feelings, the way you grew, you know, learning, all that is just turn over a leaf. Okay, give some love to it. Some of you want to give some love to someone in the past, which you can go forward on, but you confused on yourself because you probably keep hearing let go of the past, but it's you need to know what you want and bring the past to the future. Be down to earth. 
everything in the past you can't have so understand what you really fighting for of course you don't want nothing that's conflictive in your future so that's one thing you know you let go of okay Okay, so oh, a passionate opportunity here. Yes. Okay. Uh uh. -oh. All right. So some of you want to walk into one. So you you walking away from the past into a passionate opportunity. Nice. And here we are, third party energy, probably because of the past and the, the present. And um, here we are, page of wands, and you very passionate about them. So you feeling like it's something there, but you're undecided with this confusion energy. Don't know if you're able to get it done, be with, have it. Okay. So it looks as if you walked away. And now you want something new, but now you are confused in the head is if you should have walked away, are you going to get something new? Okay, don't be all so confused, Gemini. Trust the universe, okay? Who is this? The lovers, almost in it. Trust yourself. You know, you're not happy. Go. The universe will say you sound happy, but you got to let go of the unhappiness, right? Just makes sense. Yeah, plenty of options, but you got to just go into them. You have them, so don't feel stuck. So as you explore your options right now, what you're doing, two of pentacles, you're not balancing the past. Some of you are dropping the past totally, wanting brand new things to come in, even to fill up the whole past, present, and future, right? Temperance, not even caring, not really balancing it. Dropping the 100% ball. I see that. So, Knight of Swords. But some of you not clear on where this can leave you at. You know, especially your image. So, be careful how you drop things. Right? Some shit do break and shatter. So, you may just want to set shit down. Set it aside. Let it alone. Right? <laughs> Ooh, Gemini. So... Let's see what you need to be doing. Goodness. Say, so let it go. Mm -hmm, but you're going to have to decide to do so. Okay, it's like all the love that was there, you, you felt it, and now you deep in love with whatever love that you see. That's the love you probably don't want to give to it no more, right? So you want to sustain yourself and stay focused. Focus on yourself, Queen of Pentacles, and start gaining. Just let that shit go. Walk away, right? But it's burdens that you're carrying from it. And it's like the universe understands. So it's like it told you what to do with the High Priestess Reverse. It's like I'm not repeating myself. Let the past go. Drop that two of cups. Go start getting some money. Whatever you feel, you can. You feel free to feel it. But I still told you what I told you. <laughs> I don't know why the universe being so hard, Gemini, but it's a walk away. You walked away already, right? So it's something greater coming in. Some of you have to believe. You know, believe in yourself. You have so much energy here of yourself. The lovers. Okay, last one. Yeah, some of you went within trying to figure out about a situation. Let me see what happened. Okay. Oh, you stopped going forward with it. All right. You say, fuck that shit. I'm out this bit. Put it in park. Screw, screw. 
I no longer look at them as that star. I'm the star, probably, right? You probably kind of reversing it on yourself, even. Gemini, I do see you taking the other side, right? You no longer love them. Damn, everything reversed, right? You figuring that out. You seeing that, actually. It's coming down in your heart, in your lap, through your vision. And, wow, the universe took you through that so you can realize, you know, that wasn't so bad, right? Not, not a major heartbreak. It is what it is. So, it probably more so was the soulmate energy, right? You was there to collaborate. You probably feeling in some type of third-party love. And now it's time to stop going forward on it. But, you know, it's kind of hard to realize. Right? But now that you do. Okay, congratulations. This is a step because I believe a lot of you will no longer ever get your heart broken. Okay, graduating. Okay, six of pentacles, having some even give and take. That's what you're doing, stepping into it. No longer taking nobody else. Six of swords, going back into that storm. I can tell you why because some of you haven't finished with the lesson. You probably learning, you know, cooperate with the universe to. Gain more wisdom and all that. But as you go back into that storm and communicate going forward with it, it's like you're playing the trickery, even minding yourself, because you know for a fact you already stopped going forward with it, but it's something that's pulling you back, right, to see if you can be victorious with it. And you can because it's more like a hump you will get over, okay? Night of Wands, and you'll figure what you're truly passionate about. That's all. That's what you're going through right now. It's a test from the universe, especially since you just graduated. Congratulations once again. Okay, so what you need to be doing, give some love to the situation, to yourself, okay? Don't hate. Not on yourself, not on them. Don't worry. Everything for a reason. The universe bought you in my life to teach me a lesson. Don't worry. I learned mine. Did you learn yours? That's how that goes, okay? So, Princess of Wands, as you're passionate, it's like a brand new passionate opportunity. Just fuck it. My passion's done kick back in. No telling where I'm headed with this. Here we are. It's an opportunity out there you no longer want. You probably learn how to take these opportunities. And you move through it. And here we are. Being that motherfucking star. Yes. Third party energy. Congratulations, Gemini. Yes, babies. You are the baby. Showing them how to do it. Won't fuck over a Gemini. Sure enough, won't. Won't fuck over me. Most definitely. So just go ahead. Keep your passion itself up. All the way to the top. High vibration. Go through the opportunities. You, you done with it? Okay, I'm done. <laughs> I'm moving on. They're going to be like, damn, how you did that? Because I got my opportunity. A bright one, too. It's just not it. It's not everything for me. That's just it. So let's get some energy cards. Yes, congratulations once again, Gemini. This is some great energy. You know how long we've been waiting to get here? Right? So we are here, honey. A lot of you are taking that Virgo energy. Yes, and building your bubble. <laughs> I'm taking my opportunities. I'm down to earth. Grabbing that Capricorn energy with... It's not really being greedy. It's just making sure you get it all, okay? And then... Some Taurus energy, um, that's the make sure of the getting it all. <laughs> okay, so Virgo is the opportunity, right? Then the Capricorn like, uh-uh, I got to go get it. We, we got to get it all. And then the Taurus like, it get done. Okay, so take all that into consideration with all this earth energy. That's all you have. Okay, right now, I don't know who you messing with, but. Especially if you're messing with an earth sign. 
You don't want to be left out behind trying to figure out how they do what they do when you can do damn that the same thing even more powerful. Don't tell them that, though. <laughs> the thinking man, if you think about it, but, you know, no secrets. <clears throat> People that know, know. People that don't know, don't know. It's like, why you didn't tell me? I did. You just didn't understand. I would hate to say you just was not listening. Right? Strategy. I'm telling you, is a certain strategy. You have to strategize. Get it right. While you busy playing, playing Jane and people out here making the magic happen, strategizing, making the 1,000% out of everything. The journey. Even when you have to journal shit down so you can remember, you can't forget. Put it in a bank. There's too many cards and they all reverse. Patience with yourself, babies. Have some patience. You are all tied up to your destiny, not to nothing else. Okay? Don't let them spirits get you. Trust me. Um, I don't understand the depression and all that, but don't let no one hold you back. Get up out of that energy. Get a cleanse so you don't feel like they have some power. You have the power, Gemini. Okay, door to spirit. Open it up so you can get all the way and no one can touch it to your full potential power. Six chakra, archangel, Metatron, everything you touch, everything you build all the way to the top will be strong and firm. You see all that light, white, blue energy up there in the air? Fucking twin towers. Okay. Can't fuck with it. Man holding the heart. Some of you done gave your love out too much. You probably scared to give it out again. But you have to keep giving love until you find it. So you don't want to give too much. And that's what the universe is teaching you. Coming across every opportunity. The more opportunities you have. The more you have to express some type of. So be careful. Strategize. And don't forget what you all tied up to. Don't get all tied up into. Have patience with yourself. Hold your heart. Stop right now in your tracks. Because some of you need to revert and do. Okay? Make the magic happen that way. Hidden agenda. Nobody business but yours. Focus. Illness before you get ill because it's going gonna, it's gonna to keep wearing you down because you're not doing you. Okay, so do your best to do you. Y'all getting so many cards, Gemini. So many. Spirituality, get it together. Distraction, that's all they up for. Don't let them distract you. Assurance, you need some assurance. A lot of you need to be moving, stopping, staying positive, cooperating, collaborating. I know it's back here some way. Well, to stay healthy against this illness. Come on now. Other people, you need to grow, right? But other people want, it's like what people want for you, but what you really need to do. Okay? Show people what you do is healthy for you. I love you, babies. Can't wait to see you next time here on the 305 Goddess channel. Check, check. Love you, babies. Bye. Have a great one.